morning at, at this point, everything is now pretty steady state. Uh, the storm is out in the Atlantic and beginning to pull away from the United States. Our rain chances are going down and we're breaking out into full sunshine. Our thing that we're watching for this afternoon is a coastal flood warning. That coastal flood warning is up for Charleston County and coastal Colleton County with coastal flood advisories in place for the rest of the coast. The high tide that occurs around 2 o'clock is going to produce about 1 to 2 feet of standing water across a good part of the coastal sections of South Carolina. That includes downtown Charleston. So just make sure that you're aware of that as we move through the afternoon hours, there will be some problems to deal with uh, with road closures and even some property flooding when we have tides of this level. Wind speeds have been holding between 15 and 20 sustained. Now they're starting to inch just above 20 as the strongest winds of the day are going to be between now and say early afternoon. We are getting occasional gusts of 30 plus and those will be with us for the next hour or two and then we'll start to see the winds subside. Partly to mostly sunny as we move through the rest of the day today with temperatures right now in the low 70s. This puts us right on target to hit our afternoon high temperatures in the low to mid 70s. The strongest winds again now through one o'clock they will subside that risk of tidal flooding that will be with us into the late afternoon hours and then overnight we clear out and we're setting up for a gorgeous weekend. Tomorrow we'll be in the upper 40s, low 50s. Yes, yeah, it's going to be a chilly morning tomorrow. We'll end up in the low to mid 70s and then upper 70s, low 80s return for Saturday and Sunday.